Hi everybody, my name is Dave Marsh. I'd like to welcome you to this quick tip tutorial. And today we're gonna to take a look at how to quickly share a link to properties sent from Matrix. Now before I begin, I'd first like to mention that because each MLS may have slightly different requirements, the system that we'll be using during this tutorial may differ slightly from the one that you're currently working with. Nevertheless, the functionality is the same and for the most part, whatever you see during this tutorial, you'll easily recognize in your own system. All right, so for anyone who's familiar with Matrix, you already know that as an agent, you're able to send properties to a client either from a direct or an auto email. However, occasionally, you may also wanna share properties with a prospect who's not yet a Matrix contact. To do this, we'll first need to select the properties that we'd like to share. Next, I'm gonna select the share link option from the send action button. And from here, simply add a title that best represents the properties being sent. Then generate and copy the link. All right, so with our link ready to paste, we're now able to send it to our prospect. And again, if the intended recipient is already a matrix contact, then we'll wanna send these properties in a direct or auto email, not by sharing this link. And the reason for this is so we're able to view and manage all of the client's one home activity from their matrix contact section. And for our client, they'll appreciate having all of the property sent to them in one central location. But because this recipient isn't yet a client, we're going to share this link either by text or in an email. So let's go ahead and send this to our recipient. And what our prospect will see when they click on the link are all of the sent properties contained within a professionally branded one home portal. But again, because the recipient isn't yet a matrix client, they'll have no access to any of the standard one home features. And they'll only be able to view these specific properties that were shared with them in the link. All right, well, this concludes this quick tip tutorial. I'd like to thank you for watching and hope that you can join me for another session. Take care.